Spring is almost here and we've got two problems on crepe myrtle that we've got to deal with before spring begins. The first issue could be an insect infestation called crepe myrtle bark scale. If you've got crepe myrtle that has a black sooty substance on the stems, maybe some white specks or cottony masses, then you've had this scale problem and we need to deal with it right now. Most crepe myrtles may be too large to spray, so applying a systemic insecticide drench in March or early April can be effective. You can spray an insecticide in April and May to control the young scale crawlers before they damage the plant if your crepe myrtle is short enough to reach with a sprayer. Now, speaking of size, the other issue with crepe myrtle may be to prune or not to prune. Lots of people chop the tops of crepe myrtle branches yearly. We call this crepe murder, and it's not a wonderful thing to do. When possible, try to have the crepe myrtle grow its natural size while only thinning lower branches and any dead growth. If possible, let your crepe myrtle grow to its ultimate size, only thinning out the lower branches or maybe taking out the dead. But the good news here is that if you have to crepe murder your plant, this crepe myrtle will still grow back and it will still have lovely flowers for this summer.